Hey, what's going on, guys? Today I am going to show you the Fall Guys Season 6 Fame Path, and I will be going through what all the outfits, colors, crowns, kudos, and, and much more inside of the Fame Path. Also, there's one interesting thing about this, but there we will no longer be getting one crown in battle passes well at least i think because uh i'll explain in a bit as but anyways let's uh go inside and see the new fame path let's begin <laughs> Alright, so here is the Season 6 Battle Pass. I will be giving credit to uh, the person who made this. His YouTube channel will be linked down in the description. As you can see, that's his Twitter account um, underneath the words. So yeah, I will be giving this guy credit. Just so y'all know. That way um, I don't like publish without permission. So alright, well, let's begin. <laughs> So as you can see for tier 2, we have the Carnifaller, looks pretty nice. And for tier 3, we have Bacon and Eggs. Now for tier 4, we have the Party Starter, which is um, a pretty cool nickname, not gonna lie. And I like how it's like at the beginning of the Battle Pass and it's called Party Starter. I, pr I really like that. And for tier 5, we get our very first crowns, and this is where it gets interesting. It says two crowns, so does that mean we will no longer be getting uh, one crowns from the battle pass? Maybe, or maybe not, I'm not really sure about this, but let's move on to the next one. For tier 6, you get to complete that carnivore outfit, so yeah, pretty nice, pretty nice. Again, just like uh, the crowns, you will not uh, be getting a thousand kudos, as you can see, it's at 2,000. So yeah, it's pretty interesting, maybe it will change because there's no way you should be getting this much that early. But I honestly prefer this, not gonna lie. But also, one thing to point out is that at the very top, the crowns counter is not there and it is um a primo's counter which is pretty interesting as well so i wonder if the crown's counter is removed or i don't know we'll just have to find out later anyways next we have the beach ball ball and at tier 10 we have a placeholder now the placeholder outfit is unknown right now so yeah but um the placeholder outfits might be shown um after this uh video more kudos, party flags for tier 12. Looks pretty cool. The first pattern, I believe. I think. I don't know. But anyways, let's move on. The diver the nameplate. Now, this one looks pretty sick. Not gonna lie. I actually kind of like it. I like how it has, like, this gold style. So, yeah, pretty cool. More crowns. And you get to complete that placeholder outfit at tier 15 so yeah it looks pretty cool oh, wait no i can't even see it so yeah for tier 16 you get that color right there pretty cool pretty cool and the more cute you get um a new outfit at tier 18 the bottom half of the chill vibes outfit looks pretty cool pretty cool not gonna lie i like all these outfits so much Um, our very first um, faceplate, which I believe is chill, chill or something, I don't know, um, it, it went too fast. So yeah, for tier 20, you get more crowns multiplied, so now you get three. Tier 21, you get to complete that chill vibes outfit, which is sick, honestly, I like his glasses. And for tier 22, you get another cool nameplate, which is Party On. I really like that. 
it, it looks so sick. I feel like um there's a bunch of nameplates in this battle pass, but still I love nameplates since you get to like show about your personality, um kind of. But yeah, anyways, it's so nice. Alright, so at tier 23, you get the Mr. Sealson outfit. So yeah, it's pretty cool too, not gonna lie. We didn't even see the top half yet, and already I like his pants. You get 3,000 viewers, then you get the boss, uh, no, no, the 80s party, my bad. I thought that was a B. So yeah, you get the 80s party pattern at tier 25, which looks pretty sick, not gonna lie. And you get five crowns already at tier 26. And for tier 27, you get to complete that Mr. Sealson outfit, which is actually pretty cool. I like the ball. I just, I don't know, there's something cool about it. Like it looks good. And you get um a uh, nickname which is Paula Paulusia. I think that's how you pronounce it. Again, like last video, I'm not gonna pronounce that stuff that well. You get 4,000 kudos at tier 29, which I believe I haven't seen a 4,000 kudos in any battle passes like ever. Maybe, maybe I'm just, maybe I'm just capping. I don't know. All I know is that I never saw these damn, this damn number of kudos. I don't know. I think it's something new, but maybe I'm capping. I don't know. All right, and at tier 30, you get um a lady Margot, which looks pretty cool with the dress. I like that. And we're finally getting a female outfit, so that's good to know. Maybe we are. Having that. Yeah, looks pretty cool. Egg shows at tier 31 and tier 32. You get another cool pattern. Pretty cool, pretty cool. That's epic. And you get uh, three crowns at tier 33. Last time I saw it said five crowns, so that's also pretty interesting. Tier 34, you get to complete that Lady Margot outfit, which looks pretty awesome. Not gonna lie, it is a rare outfit, by the way. I have to keep an eye on the rarities for these. Another 5,000 kudos is my tier 35. Tier 36 has the just wow. Just wow how cool it is. Like, it is a cool pattern, I believe. It, no, wait, that's, that's a color, my bad. It's a cool color. Not gonna lie. So, yeah, that's uh, tier 36. Tier 37, we get a new outfit which is unknown it which is really sad that it's unknown either that or maybe it has shoes i don't know i haven't watched this folding yet it's called big yeetus probably gonna be my favorite obstacle Place 
actual outfit, which is unknown again. But yeah, overall, pretty cool battle pass. We just, I think we'll see what the placeholders are. I think they'll show it in the soon. Oh yeah, yeah, these are the two placeholder outfits. So let's see. So we have Jin Sakai, which is at tier 45 and tier 50, which looks pretty cool, not gonna lie. Looks pretty cool. I think I remember from Jin Sakai evil female at tier 10 through tier 15 which I think they look they look phenomenal they just look awesome I can't wait to grind through this battle pass I mean season 5 has already been going on strong with the events and stuff like that like the glizzy gang so yeah I'm so excited for this battle pass but yeah I think that's all so yeah, if you want to see more um, videos like this, then go on ahead and leave a like down below. I post I post videos. Well, no, I post all kinds of Fall Guys videos all the time. But yeah, that was the battle pass. You could also buy levels, by the way, and you could also and it's also purchasable, which is gonna be kind of sad. But yeah, overall, I'm so excited to play this Battle Pass. And let me know in the comments below what you think about Season 6. And I will see you in my next one. Peace out.